Stocks in 2022 are looking horrible so far, with the S&P 500 down near 20% starting from the beginning of the year as of May 23rd. Financial backers in big tech are more worried about the monetary development viewpoint and are pulling back from dangerous pieces of the market that are delicate to expansion and increasing loan fees. This is a recipe for a disturbed macroeconomic climate. While financial exchange unpredictability is typical for the time being, market shortcomings such a long way in 2022 has financial backers stressed over additional descending development. In this video, we will talk about the stock crash of 2022 and what can be done. So let's begin. Reasons for the crash Number 1. High Inflation the U.S. economy is encountering constantly elevated degrees of expansion. Expansion, estimated by the Customer Value Record, or CPI, is the pace of progress in costs of labor and products over the long haul, and costs have been consistently rising, adding to securities exchange unpredictability. The most recent CPI, perusing in April, expanded 8.3% on a yearly premise, close to the most significant level the American shopper has found in over 40 years. In the event that expansion perseveres, it tends to be an immense weight for customers, particularly in the off chance that rising costs are not counterbalanced by rising wages. In the interim, more exorbitant costs for natural substances, stock, transport, and work have impacted corporate asset reports. While organization profits in 2022 have, to a great extent, developed, expansion inconveniences have harmed overall revenues. High expansion disintegrates shopper certainty and can slow financial development, discouraging the portion of public corporations. 2. Increasing interest rates As expansion is a significant financial concern, the Federal Reserve, looking to keep an objective of 2% expansion over the long haul, will probably keep on fixing money-related strategy. This includes raising financing costs. While expanding financing costs isn't pointed toward pounding the securities exchange, this strategy comes down on values. In an increasing loan fee climate, organizations will generally scale back spending. The economy can dial back, and the pace of corporate profit development might direct to these elements unavoidably influence stock costs. 3. Russia-Ukraine War Russia's attack of Ukraine has added to momentary securities exchange unpredictability in the U.S., furthermore, all over the planet. Numerous nations, especially in Europe, have been dependent on Russian energy trades that have been upset by the conflict. Presently, the European Union is pushing toward a settlement on a Russian oil ban. The U.S., given a restriction on imports of Russian oil, condensed petroleum gas and coal in March, and has since been attempting to increase homegrown assets. Russia creates generally 10% of the world's oil, and even with expansions in U.S. oil creation, costs are probably going to stay raised for the time being. 4. Inventory Network Issues Inventory network disturbances are another sad reality coming about because of the COVID-19 pandemic. Despite the fact that the U.S. economy has apparently endured the most terrible of the pandemic, it is as yet managing lingering worldwide store network difficulties. For example, in Apple Inc., or AAPL's monetary second quarter profit call on April 28th, CEO Tim Cook cautioned that production network disturbances exacerbated by China's most recent COVID-19 lockdowns could slice $4 billion to $8 billion from income in the ongoing quarter. As interest for labor and products keeps on developing, creation should get up to speed. If not, organizations' capacity to satisfy clients' needs will be confined, harming benefits. 5. Unreasonable Work Costs some uplifting news is that the joblessness rate stayed at 3.6% in April, the most reduced rate since February of 2020. In any case, there are a large number of occupations accessible. In any case, the low joblessness rate implies the work market is more cutthroat, which has driven a few organizations to one or the other settle up their labor force or scale back on work. Microsoft, MSFT, has expanded pay and stock remuneration to keep its representatives almost multiplying its financial plan. Be that as it may, Robinhood Markets, H. OOD is cutting 9% of its full-time workers. Netflix and FLX has laid off 150 workers across the organization, and Peloton Interactive PTON, has laid off 2,800 laborers. 6. China's Financial Drag China's zero-COVID-19 strategy is brutally affecting the country's monetary standpoint. In any case, China's re-established pandemic emergency is likewise difficult worldwide stock chains which brings about greater cost and deficiencies of certain merchandise with more extensive reach. Since China has the world's second biggest economy, its inconveniences raise worries about the prosperity of the worldwide economy. Worldwide organizations like Apple, Tesla, TSLA, and Toyota, TM, which have fabricating activities in China, are seeing huge headwinds for creation, deals, and benefits. 
7. Frail Profit Organizations are confronting headwinds from numerous points. Value expansion is coming down on corporate profit, and as the Federal Reserve adopts a more hawkish strategy to its financial approach, this thus comes down on dangerous resources like stocks. While a larger part of market areas experienced development in 2022's most memorable quarter, a few organizations are confronting more fragile net revenues. The purchaser, optional, and financials areas are detailing year-over-year decreases in profit, as per a May 20th fact set examination. Purchaser optional has taken the greatest profit hit of every one of the 11 areas, falling 33.2%. Financials revealed the second biggest decay, with a drop of 19.8%. In excess of 60 organizations in the S&P 500 list have given negative second quarter profit per share direction, FactSet reports. What you should do in such a situation? Number 1. Fight the temptation to sell in a panic. During market redresses, auctioning off your speculations could appear to be smart. Negative news, for example, a pandemic, a resource bubble that is going to explode, tricks being uncovered, and so on, can impact any financial backer. Nonetheless, verifiable information shows that the best and most awful performing days of the financial exchange are frequently very near each other. In any case, by and large, markets have consistently recuperated from an accident, and on second thought of selling in a frenzy, you ought to simply keep even-headed and permit your systemic investment plans SIPs to proceed in the event that you figure out how to keep effective financial planning regardless of your economic situations you will receive the benefits when the business sectors recuperate sometime in the future Two, keep your portfolio rebalanced portfolio rebalancing is a system that aids in lessening the general gamble in your speculation portfolio to give better gamble changed profits from your ventures this methodology includes training ventures intermittently so the heaviness of every resource class is kept up with according to your designated assignment in this way the initial phase in rebalancing your portfolio is to have a resource distribution methodology set up on the off chance that you don't have a resource distribution plan set up as of now a financial exchange crash offers you the ideal chance to check out your ongoing ventures. 3. Exploit Tax Laws The benefits created by selling mutual funds or stocks are called capital gains, and these are dependent upon capital gains tax assessment rules. A fall in the securities exchanges can be an optimal chance to build the post-government forms on your speculation by utilizing a strategy called charge misfortune reaping. Charge misfortune gathering includes unloading your mutual funds or stocks at a bad time with the goal that you can collect a capital misfortune. The capital misfortune can then be balanced against capital additions from different speculations to diminish your taxation rate and increment the post expense forms from your ventures. The duty misfortune reaping procedure is generally utilized by financial backers toward the finish of the financial year, that is, in the long periods of February and March. However, this is certainly not an immovable rule, so the procedure can be utilized whenever during a monetary year. 4. Put resources into equities, but choose carefully. While equities are less expensive when securities exchanges tank, it is fundamental to be cautious when making these speculations. One method for profiting from the lower cost of equities is to change the designation in long-haul ventures like National Pension Systems NPS, and Unit-Linked Insurance Plans ULIPs. The two NPS and ULIPs are long-haul speculations with long-term secure in periods. A securities exchange crash gives you the ideal chance to build your equity distribution at a sensible expense and permits you to change to a more forceful resource portion from a similarly safe designation. Five. Fight the temptation to make panic buys. Like making alarm deals during a market decline, you generally should not make alarm purchases during a market slump. Alarm purchasing can be portrayed as a perspective that pushes you to make ventures unpredictably, which can turn into a hindrance to arriving at your ongoing speculation objectives. A stock market crash offers financial backers a remarkable chance to develop their riches. However, to exploit this accident, you should have an arrangement set up before the accident occurs. The causes and methodologies examined are intended to assist you not just climate the 2022 market with declining better, yet additionally ensure that you can develop your abundance fundamentally when markets recuperate sometime in the not-too-distant future. That's all from this video. Thanks and goodbye.